Welcome back Doom fans to more relearning Doom map editing with the GC Doom Builder. The link to said program is in the description below. I just want to say I'm sorry that I have called it editor up to now. It is builder, obviously. Also, it's easier to say. Anyway, on <laughs> with the show. Uh, in the last video we covered elevators and teleporters. Today we are going back to doors, but this time we're going to make them sliding and swinging doors. I also have to introduce you to an additional program called Slade, but all this will be explained. Link to that will be in the description as well. Lastly, I have to thank two fellow YouTubers for this video. One for sound with Slade, more on that later, and uh, one for the swinging doors that I was not even aware existed. Once again, links to their channel will be down below. So with no further ado, let's get started, shall we? All right, let's make a sliding door then. I've done some preparations for this door making tutorial. We have um, a normal uh, door frame, but we will not be lowering this because th this will not, this sector will not be the door. You might have noticed I had another sector here that's a dummy sector that we will be using for the door, or rather this will be the door that will go here. So we need to do some preparations for this door. Firstly, let's actually make sure that we can... No, hang on, I'm getting ahead of myself. Let's make... Well, we would call the end. I don't think it matters which end you use for this part of it, but I'd like to use the side that will be where the, the hinges are. So let's right click on this one. We are going to make it the first on our list poly object start line. Holy object number one for our first door and just give it one for the sound number as well. We will, um, I will explain this more once we get into uh, Slade. So yeah, uh, we are going to make sure we can use it as a door repeatable action when player press touch we will go to number eight poly object door slide the object is one uh, movement speed let's keep it at fast movement angle before you had to eyeball the direction but now we want it to go this way. Yep, just press this thing and it will, uh, can choose any angle you want from this. 128 in this case. Movement distance is, well, this door is 128 long. But I want a bit of a lip to show wh when uh, the door slides. So let's say it goes 126. And we have a delay of 3, that's fine. I think we can handle that. Alright, now we need to add a thing. More specifically, we need to add not sure if it have to be centered, but let's do it anyway. Uh, poly object anchor, which is under 
ZDoom object in the edit thing editor. Give it an angle of one. Uh, it starts at 270, I believe. But let's keep it at one. I think that's all we need for that. Here, where the door shall start, we will need to add another thing. A starting spot with the same angle, so they are connected. This is sort of instead of uh, adding a tag. I'm not quite sure why it works like that, but it does, so don't sweat about it. And I think that is our goal. Pretty much trust. Let us test it and see if it works. We will add sound later. I'm going to make another door first, but let's just test that this works first. Let's see. We have a door. And it opens. We can go through. And it closes. And I can even stand here. And it won't even hurt me. See? A bit, bit of a lip instead of it just disappearing into the wall. Just like a real door would. Uh, so that is the mystery of... Uh, the sliding door. Now let's go on to making a swing door. Alright, let's make a swinging door then. Process is much the same. We need to have a line with the poly object start line. Poly object number will be two. Uh, I don't really have a good sound for uh, swinging doors yet. So just let's just leave it at zero, so we don't have a sound. Uh, if you find one, be um, you can happily put one there if you want. If I put one there now, it will get the sound of the sliding door. Which we will put in later. And that's about it. Um, those lines make it when player press use, but do not <laughs> do not choose repeatable because well um. Just don't, okay? It will clip or go around and because this door will not close again. And we're going to choose rotate right. Poly object number is two. Uh, yeah, yeah, fine. Go away. Fast is. Okay, well, let's make it normal. And let's choose North. You might have to tinker with this, uh, depending on which way it's going to uh, swing. I want to swing inwards and stop here. So this should be okay. So, okay. And once again, Thing anchor with an angle of two, so it doesn't interfere with the first one. And we need an anchor, or not an anchor, but a start spot there. And I think that is pretty much what we want. So, so let's test it. Um, uh, 
if we press it will open and stay open uh, yeah when it swings it will um, it will um, move the texture somewhat and it might look a bit odd when you when it's open but it stays open so you can't really do anything about that make sure you don't have anything uh, physical that can block the door if you don't want that effect um, yeah and we still have our um, sliding door over here so let's give that door sound shall we all right welcome to Slade I have closed my wood file in uh, and the build GZ build uh, editor temporarily so we don't get any conflicts with this I've opened the word file I want in Slade the tutorial one uh, experiences may vary depending on how much stuff you have in it but it should look something like this I want you to add three items. One, two of them will be new entries. We will call them sound. Um, info. and sound um, hang on I have a note somewhere yeah I am not quite comfortable with this program just yet so I have my notes for it and I want you to import the sound file you want to use in my case I just found someone uh, some file that I uh, edited uh, it has to be in the waveform so use your um, sound editor of choice to make sure that it is preferably a short name since doom don't really like long names but I think it will be okay anyway so we have the sound in wave format now in these two files we will add name of our um, sound in my case slide door one one and once more don't ask me why it's how it works save it and we're done with the info in the sound sequence I assume it means we will add what well, we need a name so let's just call it slide door sound this will not actually matter because um, you can call it whatever you want 
and we can end it. Now in the middle we will add the door sound. So door and remember the number one. So let's put one there. I put one space because it doesn't matter if we add a couple more, I think. We shall add play and the name of the sound file, which, which is uh, slider, not point, slider one. We shall add no stop cut off. This is just so that um, any other game sounds will not be muted while we run this, I think. Was there more? Yes, end. We already have end. So let us save. And we're going to save this. I just pressed Control S. I guess you can save like this if you want. Now we're going to close um, Slade and go back to uh, our um, DC Doom Builder and see if I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, just a side note. Uh, remember when I talked about having your wits about you, tongue in cheek and all that? Remember to check that your files are named correctly. If you saw that and facepalmed, well, now I have fixed it. So now there will be sound because there was not uh, the first time around. Yep. So let's have a look at how it sounds, shall we? Well, now I know it works, but uh, you don't. So let's go in and have a look anyway, shall we? <laughs> oh, it's a sliding door. Whatever shall we do? Shall we open it perhaps? made a sound made a sound again well we <laughs> have lift off so yeah well now we have today we have made a sliding door a swinging door. Not sure if I want to use the swinging door that much, but at least we have. Um, I have shown you how to make one. You can add sound to the swinging door in the same manner, but I don't think the sliding door sound would uh, fit with this one. So I'll have to find a swinging door sound to make that possible. Yeah, and we have looked a bit at Slade to make um, to make a sound or add a sound for it, uh, and that's about it for me in this video. <laughs> Errors and all, it works now. So uh, this was your host. The Lazy Gamer, logging off. Bye guys. <laughs>